Pam Bondi and campaign senior advisor Corey Lewandowski. They've been traveling a lot in these battleground states in the last 48 hours. challenging local and state election officials. Remember, Corey Lewandowski was one of the president's campaign managers in 2016 for a time. And I believe we also have another view of this as well. Here, you'll see Trump supporters holding Trump pence signs awaiting this press conference from campaign officials of the Trump campaign. Obviously, ballots are still being counted in Pennsylvania, especially there in Philadelphia County. And it looks like officials are about to come up to the podium. Still remains to be seen when we'll have final results out of Pennsylvania. President Trump on election night was up in the state. Biden has really made up lost ground in this ballot counting because of these late mail in ballots and absentee ballots that are still being counted. So the margin has narrowed quite substantially. President Trump, though, still ahead, but not by as much as he was on election night. And there you see Pam Bondi and Corey Lewandowski coming to the microphones. Let's listen in. Thanks, 
listen to a judge's order. What has America come to? This judge has ordered us inside to review this process and the Board of Elections, and your sheriff said no. So what do we do? We go get relief by the federal government to make sure every legal vote is counted. Thank you very much. We believe every legal vote should be counted, and we have the right to look at those votes, and we're going to make sure every single vote is counted. Thank you, guys. And there is the Trump, uh, part of the Trump campaign there, Corey Lewandowski and Pam Bondi in Philadelphia, PA, talking about uh, they have just filed their a federal lawsuit in Pennsylvania. Uh, their, their motto is that we want to count every legal, legal vote versus counting every vote there.